Jose! Jose, go Ness! Why do you want him to go, go Ness? Ness! Ness. He's, he's gonna no, let him. Sorry, I couldn't let Jose go back then. <laughs> that would have been fun to watch, though. No, it wouldn't be fun watching. Well, it wouldn't be fun for him. Eat every single thing that Pac-Man throws out. All right, so they're going into the match, going to Starsville. I want some cheese to happen. I want to watch Villager die at a hundred from a back throw. Yeah, but he can also get pocketed. I mean, <laughs> if he gets off stage, we'll see what happens though. This this can go the way. All right, off to like a medium start right now. It's like very. Okay, so. Oh! Me or him? Oh, okay. okay Alright, so. Oh, he. No, that was a smart That was a smart choice because he could have gotten pocketed right yeah. there. If he, if he went any lower, that would have given Kino just enough time to get back onto the stage safely. Technically, he still should have been able to punish that, but. It definitely caught him off guard, so he brought back. He got back. And I like how Jose is taking an aggressive approach right now to to fighting Villager. Get hey. that early percent. Oh, he got that. Now he knows Ooh. he can't get pocketed. Here he goes. Oh! Hey, that was good, on. good uh, presence of mind that uh, Jose used. He waited for Villager to grab the ledge twice and knew that he was going to be able to get a guaranteed spike. I went for this spike. And this could actually be bad for Ness. Very if well he gets done. a triple turn up, he's dead. Oh, that was very bad oh, punish by Hino. Is, yeah, th yeah, he could have just stayed on the up. stage and got a, a turn up. Probably a uh, number two turn up probably could have killed him. Too. That's what I'm saying. He could have just gone up, but he's not. A, I don't think he's expecting it because most people don't do that against him. Just kind of like oh. That's a punish that Jose missed. Oh, now he's dead. He should have been dead. Yeah, he's just dropping the ball a lot. This is not looking like that at all. <laughs> yeah, you know, this isn't looking like Hino at all. Usually Hino yeah. is spot on with his punishes. And Jose is doing some really good spacing right now. He just needs to get on some more extra credit and then he'll be happy. Yeah, he the breed of breed. Or, well, Jose keeps missing punishes too. Yeah. He just missed another one. I think he's reacting late to it. It's been a while since he's been in the corner, right? I mean, he's been out, stayed for the most part. I thought that slingshot was going to kill him. Yeah, that's him too. But, oh, that was so he could've, dangerous. He could have just jabbed or held a grab right there. He could have. Grab back throw at this percent for an ass? He can kill early. They're both making very questionable options right now. And that slingshot, if he know would have timed that a second earlier, that would have killed him. Yeah. No, that would have killed him. Ooh, okay, now. Uh -oh. go high. Aim for the platform. That's a little too high. Oh and then, my <laughs> goodness! <laughs> but the and the triple turn up gets a soft spot, so that's not gonna kill him. Yeah. There you go. Ooh. Unfortunately, he had to pocket him at 150%. <laughs> Alright, now, I, in my opinion, it would be in Jose's best interest to get away from the side of the stage. Yeah. Hey, why? Because if he gets thrown off and Hino reads an air dodge, he's gonna get gimps. True. He's gonna get pocketed. But he, he has a kill though percent, right? Yes, point. he is. If he gets hit with a bowling ball. Uh oh. He betrayed the trades. So you see him trying to push him off stage right now. Not really working as much as he would like to, as you can tell. Um, but he's playing. The, uh, he knows playing the game really patient. Oh! Until it happened, until he and that actually reflected the bowling yeah, ball as well. Yeah, totally. Did that happen? Okay, that happened. <laughs> Very nice. Well, Jose's thinking me in his head right now. That was a well. For telling him to go Ness and not Pac-Man. I wonder what brought him to do the bat, because it looked like he threw the bat out at the same time he threw the bowling ball. I feel like that could have been uh, just like a just an input error. I felt like he tried to do an F tilt. Oh. But we it, take those. Yeah. yeah. We take those. So we're gonna take him. I would take him to Dreamland. It gives him a lot of room to Kim uh, Ness. Maybe even Battlefield, but I think Dreamland would screw him over a little bit more. Very bad for us. Oh, he's gonna go off you. Because that's cool too. Alright, so round two. Jose took the first one here. You see the adaptation. Hopefully they both fix their errors here and they're not, you know, missing punishes and whatnot. Miss inputs. Maybe that gets out the way. Probably just had to do collection close. Good start for Hino though. Racking 30% on. That's gonna help him out really in the long run. I think Jose, do you think he's familiar with the villager matchup? Um, yes, he's dead. <gasps> no. Oh! Well, you're right, he's dead. You're right, he's dead. <laughs> he know missed so many key punishes. That's a lot yeah. of damage. I it's feel like Jose doesn't know the timing. It's just, um. He, the timing he, does, he doesn't know the timing. Like, if he shoots out a gyroid and he shoots out, um. He has like a, a PK fire or something like that. Yeah. Okay, Jose's getting really 
uh, greed right now. Right now, he wants to just throw in that percent. So if he, you know, if he does lose his stock, he's gonna have all that percent to yeah. fall extra back credit. on when. Yeah. He needs that extra credit. Right? Never hurts to get extra credit. Oh, that was really good grab range. Yeah. Yes. He could have gone for another grab. That would have been epic. I thought it was gonna be a good grab. Uh, well, so. Like, I feel Hino is good at this matchup, it's just, uh oh. It's a different Ness. It's yeah, he's really aggressive. Yeah. He's like, oh, I don't know. Jose's really aggressive, and I feel like maybe Hino's not used to that. Yeah, he's definitely not used to Honestly, Jose could have done a lot better with taking, uh, with getting extra percent versus Hino. Yeah, he could, he could have very... See? Because, like, if he, if he read that air dodge, the Nair could have killed him. Missing this link, so it makes it up for the second one. Ooh. Tries to make the reads. Why is he going for the hard reads? Why is he going for the back throw at not kill percent? Not kill percent. <gasps> Puts him in a really tough spot. Misses the down the two frames. And if Kino gets grabbed one more time, he is dead. Oh, okay. So he gets composure. Oh, it's he, neutral. I liked how Hino stood right there. He was trying to go for a hard read. Yeah, he was. <gasps> like, uh -oh. I dare you to roll. That's not. Whoa! That was some phenomenal recovery, and Jose takes it 2-0. -oh. I don't even know what to say about that, but... <laughs> now that's, okay, that's an upset right there. Yeah, that's an upset. Very nice job. I'm upset for you now, right now. Well, up. well. No bias, I just want the underdog to win. Yeah, no, I always underdog. want the underdog to win, I think that's hype. That was pretty hype, I'm not gonna lie. It, was, it seemed very confident on one end, though. Like, Jose played like he knew what he was doing. I feel like that wasn't the case. I feel like there could have been a lot more that Hino could have done. Yeah, definitely. If there was a lot of misses that he just, if he capitalized properly, would have maybe have a different result.